Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. So here's your goofy meme for the day, Storm Nation. Hello, Storm Nation. Junkmaster Peter here. Hey, Peter. You know I'm in the news. Cool, right? Um, hey, Kronk. Hey. Anyway, have you seen this new One Banner Flyer? No, I must have missed it. Amazing. Come join the space. We're all welcome. Oh, and for snacks, too. What day should I be there? Every Tuesday after school in room 315. We hope to see you there. Just down for a donation for $2 or more on Wednesday to help the Honor Societies raise final funds they need to purchase Thanksgiving meals, boxes for prep families in need. Yummy. Wear your favorite t-shirts and other school-approved clothing while leasing the holiday stress for others. This is a win-win, Prepsters. Fellowship of Christian Athletes meets every two Thursday at, from 6.45 to 7.15 in room 321 for a weekly huddle. For our donuts, games, fellowship, and leadership message from college coaches and athletes, as well as IPS student athletes. Any questions? Come ask Mr. Leitzel. You do not have to be an athlete to attend. Math and English tutoring will take place every Wednesday. High school meets from 1 to 140, and middle school meets from 140 to 220. Math will meet in room 301, and English will meet in 317. This is a drop in support, so no need to sign up. Questions? See Mrs. Robinson. Hey, have you seen this new flyer? No, I have not. What is it about? It's about high school youth alive. You really should check it out sometimes. Huh, never heard of it. Well, high school youth alive is a club run by students who want to reach for school for Jesus. Oh, cool. When and where is it? It's in Mrs. Gunderson's room, two o two, from one hundred to one forty every Wednesday after school. Huh, I'll have to check it out then. Do I need to be a member? Nope, you do not. Youth alive is meant for anyone because everyone deserves a safe place to go to get connected and share whether that's your faith, identity, or testimony. We're here for you. And if you have any further questions, please contact Emma Miller or Angelina Gannon via email or find either for them in the halls. Today's stern birthdays are Maya Houghton and Mrs. Warner. Now before I get to Avogadro with our character of the week. Hey, so welcome to character of the week where I cover characters from different genres and TV shows. So let's get started. Today we have the God of Mischief. Yep, it's Loki, one of the best MCU villains out there, and can trick you with his tricks and powers too. He is working with an organization called the TVA that is out, out of time to save the multiverse. So go watch Loki Season 1 and now 2 on Disney+. Plus. <coughs> it's a great show. That's your character of the week. Stay tuned for next week's character suggested by you, the prep. Now handing it off to Fish for Horrible Facts with Fish on Tuesday. How many fingers am I holding up? Now for running it to Colin for a sports recap. Now for running it to Colin for the sports recap. Hey Storm Nation, I'm here with your sports recap. The varsity football team improves their record to 9-1 on the season as they roll past El Dorado in a 44-6 game in the first round of the state playoffs. The Storm will be heading back to the CAA state championships for the third year in a row. The Storm ran the ball 40 times against the Wolverines, racking up a total of over 330 rushing yards. Bryce Paulet finished with 200 rushing yards and three touchdowns. Drake Woolsey finished with 92 rushing yards and three touchdowns. Hunter Price also added a rushing touchdown. The Storm defense was on fire and totaled 10 sacks in the game. A.J. Stoltz, Caden Dean, Hunter Price, Bryce Paulet, Drake Woolsey all had multiple sacks. The Storm look to defend their state title as they clash with rival Heritage Mesa next Saturday, November 18th, 2023 at 3 p.m. The game will be played at Bell Bank Park. More details are to come. 
Shout out to my brother, Diego Figueroa. Get better, buddy. The results are in for the choice of the holiday spirit wear item to be produced by the business, marketing, and production class. Mateus, can you tell us which design was the most popular? The race was really close, but the overall favorite was this Mary Stormus design, which was printed on a navy crew neck sweatshirt. That's awesome. Am I right that all the choices were designed by your class? Yeah, this particular one was made by uh, ninth grader Angel Ruiz. Cool. So, what happens now? Thanks for asking. Uh, we will begin pre-sales th on the shirt this week on Wednesday and Thursday during lunches and online at surprise.org, or you can take an order at the front office. During lunches, we take cash, credit, and tap pay. This design will be printed on an Airjet cotton polyester blend sweatshirt that is super soft like my shirt, but it only costs $20. The bonus is the sweatshirt can be worn any day because it's considered outerwear, and it can be worn as Fridays as a t-shirt. But navy isn't an approved high school outerwear color. Well, true, but we got special permission from Mr. McComb. That's awesome. Yeah. So I can buy one during lunches online or in the front office this week? Yes, you can. Uh, you need to order now so we can get them to be printed and distributed to you by the second week of December. Pre-orders will be only taken until November 20th. Orders will received after that will be filled first come, first served due to limited quantities being available. Who is going to be producing these sweatshirts? Uh, me and my classmates. Our goal is to amp up the spirit wear option here at the prep, and this is our first project. Great job. Is there anything else our students should know? Uh, yes. Anyone who pre-orders a sweatshirt this week during lunch will get a candy cane. Very wow. yummy. And we'll be holding a raffle and social media campaign after the production rolls out. So stay tuned for more information, prepsers. That sounds great. So don't forget, students, get in the holiday spirit by pre-ordering a holiday crew neck for just $20 this week. Yep. Peace. The lever, crunk. Wrong lever. <laughs> oh, yeah. Why do we even have that lever? I don't know.